What's up guys, the Hackspot here, and today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to remove the uncovered jailbreak on iOS 12 through iOS 12.1.2. Alright, so I have been getting this question a lot for me, guys. You want to uninstall your jailbreak? Now, first, this method will not update your device. You will stay on the same current version of iOS that you are currently on. Second, if you do this properly, you will not lose any of your data. Your photos, your text messages, your apps will all be back to normal. And third, this is the only method that I've found that completely removes the city app and the jailbreak completely. This method I'll be showing guys is a few more steps, but it does completely remove your jailbreak, all traces of it, so you won't have any jailbreak file left on your device. You'll basically be back to stock iOS. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so there may be many reasons why you want to remove or uninstall the uncovered jailbreak. So first off, let's say your screen is cracked and you want to get it replaced by Apple. Well, usually jailbreaking just voids your warranty but if you go ahead and remove the jailbreak, they will fix your device. You basically get your warranty back. Now, let's say you also having some issues with tweaks, messing up or glitching up your iPhone. That could be annoying. So getting rid of the jailbreak can fix those issues. And all right, guys. So what you want to do is open up the Uncover iOS 12 jailbreak app that we use to jailbreak. Head over to settings on the bottom right. First, enable refresh icon cache. Now, what this will do is after the jailbreak files have been removed, this will remove the Cydia app as well. The app icon, which is usually left over. Over. Now, to remove all the jailbreak files, the tweaks, and everything, you want to enable this option right here restore root fs recover. So, enable that option too. So, let's go back over here. Now, what you got to do is tap on read jailbreak. And this will actually go ahead and remove your jailbreak. Okay, so my device is now restarting and booting back up. And we're back in. Let's go to unlock our device. My device is automatically rebooted, so I'm not sure if it fully works. Just to make sure it worked. Let's go back over here again. Do the same thing. So again, refresh icon cache and make sure again, restore root FS recover is on. So let's go back over here. Hit jailbreak again, and you want to see a pop-up message, so this might take two tries. And all right, so you should get this message right here, and that is how you know that it worked. It says, will restore root FS. This may take a while. Don't exit the app, and don't let the device lock. So don't let the device lock. If the screen starts going dim, just tap on the screen or make sure they have the screen lock set to never. Anyways, let's go ahead and hit OK. And over here, it's going to restart your device, so let's hit OK, and it will restart. Okay, so device is back on. Let's go ahead and unlock it. Here we go. Let's go and see and looks like we still have Cydia on our device so I think this issue is mostly with the iPhone 10 where the Cydia icon remains but if I go to tap on it I can see Cydia is basically not there it like loads up blank so just the icon is still there which is blank and none of her tweaks are working so like I can see I uh, had this volume tweak where it replaced the HUD and put a smaller one right there but that looks to be not working either. So that means that the jailbreak was successfully uninstalled. The only thing is that we still have the Uncover app and the Cydia app icon. Now, of course, you can remove the Uncover app just by putting in wiggle mode and hitting delete and the Uncover app is gone. But now if you want to get rid of the Cydia app, you can either hide it away in a folder or if it's really annoying you, there's a few more steps. So what we're going to be doing is basically erasing our device, putting it back to stock iOS while remaining on the same iOS version. So this will not update. And then we're going to restore from our backup to get all our data, our photos, our apps, just the way they are. So to back up all their data on your device, your photos, your apps, your text messages, your contacts, what you want to do is you can either use iCloud or iTunes on your computer. So if you want to use iCloud, simply open up settings, go over here, here and then go to iCloud and at the very bottom over here at not the very bottom close to the bottom tap on iCloud backup make sure it's enabled and tap on backup now now if you don't have enough space for a backup you can also go ahead and upgrade your iCloud and get more storage it's only 99 cents a month for 50 gigabytes so I just bought that myself but again you can also use iTunes to back up your device and that is basically free storage unlimited so I'm gonna be using iTunes because of that reason so here's my Mac again you can use Windows 2 Go ahead and open it up. So open up iTunes and now go ahead and plug your device into your computer. If it asks you to trust your device, go ahead and trust it. Now it's asking me to if I want to install the iOS 12.1.4 update. Do not ask again. I do not want to update. Otherwise, I can never jailbreak in the future. All right, so go ahead and select your device. So there's my device right there. 
All right, so the backup is complete, as you guys can see right there. I don't know what accent that was, but let's go ahead and put away the MacBook. Let's go back on the device. You can unplug it now. So now that we have our backup, what you want to do is go open up settings, tap on general, scroll all the way down, reset, and erase all content and settings. Now that's going to remove everything off your device, but again, stay on the same iOS version. And using that iTunes backup, we will put all the device information on your photos or apps or text messages all that good stuff back on our device will be back to normal so yeah we already backed up let's tap on erase now type in your passcode and just like that erase iphone this is kind of scary doing this but just make sure that your information is backed up and you should be good to go and now we got to wait hello so our device is back let's go ahead and go through the setup process again you got a fresh new iphone Except for the crack. Who named their Wi-Fi Mother of Dragons? That's so cringy. Maybe more than me. Oh my god, I also spotted Arya Stark. So we got some Game of Thrones fans over here. Alright. And here we are. You guys can see we have the option to restore from the iCloud backup or from iTunes. So I'm gonna go like from iTunes. And now we gotta go connect to iTunes. And alright, so it might take a little bit longer to connect. But here it is. And you wanna go like your last backup. So make sure that it says today or whenever you did the backup. So for me, I did today, and let's go ahead and hit continue on that. Enter the password for the backup. It's already inputted for me. And, okay, I just could not restore because iPhone is locked. Why did it lock? Hello. Go try again. Continue. Password. And now, all we gotta do is wait. You guys can see it says restore in progress. And it is done. Go into your device again with that same hello screen. And now it says update completed. So I can hit continue. Okay, and finally, welcome back to iPhone. Unlock it. And you guys can see all my apps are reinstalling. I'm not gonna update. You guys can see I'm not on the latest version of iOS. If I go back to settings, general about, you guys can see I am still on iOS 12.0.1, which is the firmware I was on when I joke broke. So all my apps and Installing. You guys can see all my photos and stuff are there and we do not have city on our device anymore So let's go ahead and type in CYD and it's not there. So there we go. We are successfully on jailbroken. We don't have the icon either. All right, guys. So that is how to remove the Uncover iOS 12 jailbreak. I know some people have like Wi-Fi issues or cellular issues. So this will fix everything. Hope you guys enjoyed. This is the Hack Spot. Peace out.